Hey, Mr. 713, how do you feel about the game coming up? Well, you know, the game is going to be really fun. You know, football is all about, you know, it's all about friends. It's all about family. How's it going, darts? Can you give me those darts? I can definitely give you those darts. You know, football is about respecting the other teams. We all know Patrick Mahomes is a great quarterback. You know, we know he's going to be doing the best he can do. How's it going, Juan? Are you feeling Good, the Chiefs bro. right now? Already. Oh, for sure. Throw this away. Bro. I absolutely can. It, As you know, you know, the Chiefs have put us on the trash can. So, you know. But, you know, we just want to be respectful, right? Because that's how we are in Houston. As we all know, Thursday night is going to be a good game. We, you have to respect the Chiefs. They have great players like Mr. Travis Kelsey. But at the end of the day, football is about friends. It's about family. It's about girlfriends, wives, fiancés. I'm just kidding. Chiefs, we're coming for you. Coming for that ass. Week one. Let's cue the intro. It's the city of the dream team. High team, two ring. Beyonce, 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 yeah, I mean. Hello everybody, welcome back to 713 Houston Sports. I'm Mr. 713, and ladies and gentlemen, we're three days away. We are three days away from shocking the NFL, and I want to welcome you guys to a brand new Houston Texans year. We have been running almost a full year, guys, on YouTube. Thank you for everybody who has watched, who has subscribed, who has liked. I love y'all personally, you know, like, like you guys, all my family. So we're going to get through another season. We're going to continue to be one of the best uh, YouTubers for the Houston Texans. And let's get on with the predictions video, ladies and gentlemen. First, we're going to look at the Kansas City Chiefs. The Kansas City Chiefs are a juggernaut. You have to give respect to them. Their offense is absolutely next level, led by Hall of Fame quarterback, future Hall of Fame quarterback Patrick Mahomes, along with a great wide receiver in Tyree Kill, a great tight end in Travis Kelsey, a very good offensive line, and a rookie running back who a lot of people are expecting to absolutely ball out. So this, this Kansas City Chiefs offense is going to score, right? We all know that. We all know that a team like this is going to score. The question is, is can you go shot for shot with them? Can the Houston Texans offense go face-to-face, toe-to-toe with the Kansas City Chiefs? That remains to be seen. Going on with their defense. Their defense is absolutely, you know, fantastic, led by Tyron Matthew, Chris Jones. They have players. They have dogs on that team. That's where they won the Super Bowl, led by head coach Andy Reid and offensive coordinator Eric Bieniemy. They're a well-run machine team. But I'm going to tell you why the Houston Texans have a chance. Why the Houston Texans have a chance is because nobody knows what this Houston Texans team is yet. Not even we know as fans. This is the first time we will not see a team with the number one wide receiver since Andre Johnson and DeAndre Hopkins. We are going to have a pick-your-poison type of offense where at any moment any one of these wide receivers can go off. We have Brandon Cooks, who has elite speed, great hands, amazing route running. Will Fuller, who if healthy, it's week one, he should be healthy, is a dangerous wide receiver, and he's going to blow the top off this defense. This Houston Texas offense has killers itself, ladies and gentlemen. David Johnson, Duke Johnson, a great tight ends, um, Jordan Aikens, Darren Ferris, who was the best red zone tight end in the NFL last season. And then you have an offensive line who, are, who a lot of people are sleeping on, and we know, guys, we know that this offensive line is going to be better. I've said before, they're going to be a top 10, but this Houston Texans offense can go shot for shot with the Houston Texans if one rail by new offensive coordinator Tim Kelly. This is going to be a crazy game, a game that everybody is going to be watching. This is probably going to be, a, you know, like millions upon millions watching like the Super Bowl. This is the first football game from COVID-19. No fans, so the Houston Texans have the advantage there. The Houston Texans had the advantage of, like I said, of them not knowing what we are. This Houston Texas team, guys, has a chance to shock the NFL. The Houston Texans have nothing to lose. They know the hate that they're getting. They know that the media doesn't expect them to be a good team. They have us going 6-10. and 10. They have us being third in our division. They had the head coach getting fired at the end of the year. They even thought Deshaun Watson was going to be leaving the Houston Texans. And I quote somebody saying, if I'm Deshaun Watson, I ask for a trade. I demand a trade. They think this Houston Texans organization is in turmoil. And we ourselves as fans know that that ain't it. Like I said, give O'Brien all the hate you want. I myself have, haven't been a fan of him, but he has the Houston Texans believing in whatever he in in in, in whatever he, he wants them to. I've said this many times before. If this Houston Texas team buys into co- uh, to coach Bill O'Brien, with that they buy into what Jack used to be saying, then this team is going to be better. Because I'd rather have somebody all the way in than not. This Houston Texas team on Thursday night football. They're going to beat the Kansas City Chiefs. They're going to barely beat them out. It's going to be 38-35. They're going to shock the NFL. And people are going to be wondering, 
is this going to work? The Houston Texans are going to shock the NFL. I am telling you right now. And if not, come back on the video. Say, hey, Mr. 713, you, you are an absolute idiot. This Houston Texas team is going to be ready to come play. Kansas City, we are ready. We heard the hate. We've heard everything. We've read everything. We've seen all the tweets, all the jokes. And you're going to see what it's like to play against a pissed off Deshaun Watson, a pissed off Bill Bryan, a pissed off Houston Texas team, a pissed off fan base. We are coming to KC and we are winning there week one.